is up my beautiful babes and welcome back to my channel we're gonna jump right into this video so this is a wig that I previously reviewed and installed and constructed if you would like to see the details and see how I made this particular wig definitely check out that video I'll have a card or it'll be in the description box down below I'm pretty much gonna be revamping this wig I wanted to do a bob with some color and that's what we're gonna get into today so you're gonna be needing your cream developer your BW2 powder I do not like this brand um, for some reason I just don't care for it and then you're gonna need some shampoo and conditioner of course I love to use this um, brand on my ex hair extensions super affordable and works amazingly and you're gonna need your color that you're gonna be doing as well I don't know what color I wanted to go for yet um, I had to go to the beauty supply store and pick out some color but I did end up finding a color that I liked which I will show later on in the video but right now I am just going in to see what I want to do so I wanted to do a bob a side part so I'm gonna go in to switch up my parting you know do some more plucking and just get that part right before I actually go in to start coloring So now that I've gotten that taken care of, now we're going to section off our hair. And this is something that I feel like is very crucial to do when you're coloring hair because it will help you be able to have control over where you're placing products and all that good stuff. So sectioning off the hair, I am sectioning off a section in the back and then I'm also sectioning off two small sections in the front. And this is pretty much where I want my color to be. See that there? So that's where those are the sections that I'm going to be bleaching. So the next clip, we are going to be going ahead and start bleaching. So these are the, my um, bowls that you want to get, mixing bowls. This is the Shimmer Light Shampoo that I mentioned earlier. And right now I'm just mixing up my batter, you know, getting my mixture nice and good. So I can go in to start to bleach the hair to lighten it. Um, I wanted to get the hair to a as blonde as I could get it, but the hair just wouldn't lift past what you will see in the next clips. Clips. So, if you want your color to pop, 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 either start off using a 613 hair, or make sure that you have some hair that can get as light as you need it to get, a hair that can get to that platinum blonde color. Um, because I didn't want to over process the hair and this hair is super affordable it's on Amazon so with it being super affordable hair that means that the quality of it is not that good unfortunately so I couldn't bleach the hair as much as I wanted to without damaging the hair so right now you just see me going in at first I started using my brush but y'all I just couldn't I had to go ahead and get my hands in there and you want to make sure that you um, be very careful when you're putting the bleach on to the root and all the other good stuff. And then also make sure that if you're going to be using different colors on your um, hair, you're bleaching it. Make sure you keep your other hand clean and all that good stuff. But since I'm just doing one color, I don't really got to worry about that. And I'm just going in, honestly, using my hand, slathering on there. Then I want to put some foil in there and let that process for about 30 to 40 minutes. Baby, let me flex with you, then go caress with you. You should know you cold, girl. I can feel your temperature. Hit the dance floor. I could one, two step with you. Do the money dance for all the times that I spent with you. Hit the tango. Hand on your handles. I won't be a vandal. Just know I'll be good to you. I see man try to step with you. Chuck the do say. What will it take for you to leave with me, oh baby? A couple drinks in both our systems. Now we fade it. Way I'm talking, I hope you don't think I'm crazy. Flex one time, baby, we can flex one time, baby, come on. I mean, I can't hear that you don't care about because I did not intend to ruin this um, 
mannequin head. But it's ruined now, it's okay, I have others, but use a foam head or wrap something around your dome head so you don't ruin it like I did. <laughs> bright as I wanted it to be so I did go ahead and let it continue process for about 15 to 20 more minutes it's not as bright as I wanted it to be but it will work for the look that I'm going for um there is some brassiness in there and I was going to go in and rinse it off with my purple shampoo but I was like you know what I'm gonna make it do what it do but don't do that make sure you wash it with the, blue, the purple shampoo guys and so this coloring the most important part this is the brand and color I'm gonna be using y'all so pretty um the camera does it no justice so this color as you can see it looks red but then when the light hit it in different lighting and angles you can see it has like some hints of purple i mean not purple child learn your colors some hints of fuchsia and pink it's just so pretty y'all so 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 pretty anyways as you can see i'm not using no particular method to put the color on i'm literally just dipping my hand in the bowl <laughs> and slathering it on the hair. Wherever you see the blonde hair at is where you want to go in and slather that color down. So that's what I'm doing. Saturating it, massaging it, make sure I get every single strand and every piece. And then I'm gonna let this sit. I think I let this color sit on the hair overnight for like 24 hours because I really wanted to be saturated and vibrant in the hair. So that's pretty much all I did with the color. So easy, y'all. Once you dye and bleach the um, bundles, it's easy to go in and put the color in this way so yeah and this was the next day like I said let the color sit for 24 hours and then the next day I came in to wash and condition the hair and this is how the color looks while it's wet we all know color looks a lot more darker when it's wet so I will be showing you guys how it looks dry in the next clip but I wanted to show you that the hair is still intact not damaged and it's good to go It's fake kills. Bang. 
original Puffing on me high grade, sipping on me liquor Girls, them I come, them I want, them I take her Bad man, me I come in, me I wanna take her Girls, them I come, them I want in on the liquor I steady sipping on my liquor Then I tell her me she give her, never trust another nigga I say she give me on the nigga Say she feeling on the nigga, say she run another nigga I Who's that, baby, tell me who's that Look back, baby, make ya look back I Move that, where ya move that Touch that, baby, be now I'm about to go into cutting my bob. Now, let me tell y'all how long it took me to cut this bob and get it right. So, this part was, wasn't the hard part. This was the easy part, getting it cut and, you know, getting the shape and look I want. The hair was so thick at the root. Like, this is one thing I didn't like about this brand of hair. It was super thick at the roots, but the bundles got thin towards the end. So when I went in to cut this hair into this bob, it was very much so giving block head, helmet head looking. It just wasn't giving at all. It was too thick and dense at the end. So I had to go in with some thinning shears to thin out the hair. I went in with my regular um, shear scissors to just, I just uh, literally spent hours just cutting hair, cutting hair, cutting hair. It was so much hair. I'm like, what is going on? <laughs> So I did not record the part where I went in with my thinning shears to thin out the hair. I'm so sorry, y'all. This took a process. You are what see me bring The only special one for me uh, Now you be the only one I see Anywhere you go I wanna be uh, Girl you feel like my friends Let's have a good time Baby I'ma make you swear Let's have a good time are digital hot combs and they get up to 500 degrees and they work so good oh my god they work so good like work so good sis like so good so i will be offering and selling those here soon i am still working on some things behind the scene to get them out for y'all want everything to be perfect so be on the lookout for that but anyways i'm going in right now to flat iron the, the wig and then i'm gonna go in to curl it and style it and do all of that good stuff y'all had so much fun with this wig like I am going to get back into doing more creative hairstyles and color. I used to be so like carefree and experiment with my hair back in college and high school and I don't know what happened. I don't know when I conformed to the basic life. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm going to get back to be, you know, and, and, and start experimenting and just showing you guys more of my creative side when it comes to the hair because it is something that I love. So going in with my hot comb again. Y'all, these hot combs are so good. I can't wait to offer them for you. But this spray. Oh my first time using this spray this Evan spray baby when I tell you your your lace ain't going nowhere 
it ain't going nowhere. I didn't even need to spray this on there because I already used my Erica J Hold Me Down Lace Glue. But when I put that on there, like my wig was stuck. Okay, stuck, stuck. So I love that Evan spray, and I'll be having a video on that as well. But yeah, I'm just going in, getting everything done and corrected, adding a little makeup to my lace part, fixing some of the, you know, makeup and all the other stuff that got up under there. Y'all see the process. But I'm going to go ahead and stop talking and let the rest of the video play out. I love y'all, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Baby, let me flex with you, then go caress with you. You should know you cold, girl. I can feel your temperature. Hit the dance floor. I could one, two step with you. Do the money dance for all the times that I spent with you. Hit the tango. Hand on your handles. I won't be a vandal. Just know I'll be good to you. I see man try to step with you. Chuck the do say. What will it take for you to leave with me, oh baby? A couple drinks in both our systems. Now we faded. The way I'm talking, I hope you don't think I'm crazy. Flex one time.